My biggest problem of people buying TV is that they don't know the science of buying TV. And that is because of two things. One, because of you. You feel that looking at the price and size is the only factor. And the second is because of the store owners who feel that putting up multiple TVs on the wall is where you can come and select it. So the entire science of buying TVs need to be changed. Now in one of my previous videos, I have shared with all of you five things that really matter while buying a TV. And one of the most important point in that was of sound output. Now sound output is most underrated, most neglected element because people feel TV is all about picture. But that is just half told story. The other half my friends come from the sound. Now if you don't have your sound fixed, you will not be able to enjoy anything that you watch on the TV. And for that reason, in this video, I am going to tell you the different types of speakers that are available in the TV and how does the TV sound really play importance in enjoying the content. Now trust me, I come from a home theatre background and I am still a believer that you need a separate sound bar or a wired home theatre setup. But in case, if you are not relying on any of these two components, then you will have to be dependent on the TV sound and that's why knowing the TV speakers is very very important for you. So let us start with the first type of speakers that is the rare firing speakers. Now rare firing speakers are one of the most common elements in most of the TVs because the TVs have become slimmer and the only position that they can be placed around is at the back. Now when you place the speakers at the back and it's close to the back wall, the sound gets reflected from this wall and reaches you. Now it looks great, right? Especially in most of our cases, we have got TV either hung up on the wall or it is close to the back wall, kept on a shelf. But, 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 if you are mounting the TV on the back wall and if the speakers on the back panel are right in the position of your TV's wall mount, then you will not be able to hear the audio clearly. It is going to overlap with the mounting kit and it is going to cause some distortion to the audio. So that is why knowing the placement of the speakers on the back panel of your TV is very very crucial. The second type of speaker is the top firing speaker. Now top firing speakers are the ones which throw the sound towards the ceiling and then it reflects back to you. Now these kind of speakers require a fall ceiling depth of under 8 to 10 feet. Also the viewing distance cannot be more than 15 feet. If you are sitting more than that or if your ceiling height is double than that and if you make a mistake of buying a top firing speaker based TV then you are not going to have any good audio experience. You will have to buy a separate soundbar or a home theater setup to compensate for it. The third type of speakers that you will see in your TVs is the bottom firing speakers. Now these bottom firing speakers reflect the sound either from the table or the shelf where you have placed the TV or from the floor. In both the cases, the viewing distance again plays a very very important role. Under 15 feet works fine. More than that, you will struggle with the audio. Especially if you are putting a carpet between you and the TV, well, 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 you will still have much of audio loss because now the sound is not getting reflected, it is rather getting absorbed. The fourth type of speakers are the front firing speakers. Now most of the modern day TVs will not see any of these front firing speakers because people want to just see picture, they don't want to see any speakers out there. But there are some brands which have now got an external soundbar attachment kit to the bottom of the TV. And with these kind of attachments, you will be able to get the best output because now there is no reflection factor. It's directly you and the speakers. So this front firing actually is the best technology. But not many TVs do that. And that is where the fifth type of speakers come into play. Now this is a proprietary technology from Sony where they are treating the entire front panel of your display as a speaker. And they do that using transducers. So there are small transducers placed behind the panel which makes the entire surface of that TV panel act like a speaker. And this technology is called as acoustic surface technology. Now this technology is available in the higher end models of Sony TVs. Over a period of time they may be translating that into the lower variants as well. But as of now if you are buying anything which is Sony Bravia 8 or 9 or 5 probably these are the TVs which will have this acoustic surface technology. Now this is one of the best technologies which will not give you any audio distortions. You will have a better clarity on the speech and if you are still struggling, 
then you have an option of connecting an external soundbar or a wired home theater setup. So the next time someone tells you that I am buying a TV which has got the biggest size, please ask him where are you placing it and what kind of speakers does this TV have? Because all of these choices play a very important role, especially while selecting the right TV for your home. Thank you so much for watching. I, Tanmay Mehta, your home theater consultant or home theater wale bhaiya, will see you again in the next video. Thank you.